Well, the time was going to come where I'd watch all these fucking dumb videos on YouTube and all of the news, as I'm sure everybody else has, and we're getting kind of sick and tired of it. Here's my stance on the gun laws. <laughs> you take guns away from everybody, and you take away the laws that were in place, background checking and, you know, permits, concealed permits, you know, this, that, and the third. You take all of these things away and make it even harder for regular, you know, regular people to have them. What you're going to do is have these politicians look at all the stats of how we're such a violent gun, you know, related country and, you know, so many people get shot. I fucking guarantee you, if you look at all these fucking numbers, the vast majority of the gun crimes in the United States of America are committed by people who come from low income areas and I, I'll just throw a number out there, this is just a number I'm just throwing out, I'd say 75% of the people who are found guilty of shooting another human being, you know, either to death or near death, don't even have a fucking permit or a weapon registered to them. It was probably bought, you know, illegally. You know, that's the fucking problem. They need to figure out how to deal with that. It's, you know, John Q. Public over there you know, with a wife and two kids, goes out, gets a concealed uh, permit, and buys himself a pistol, he's not part of the, the, the statistic who goes out and fucking shoots somebody dead over a botched drug deal. Those are the majority of the gun deaths in the United States of America are, thus what I said, low-income areas, you know, people who have guns that are not registered to them, that do not have any sort of permit nor right to carry that weapon. Now, what is hard to understand? I see all these dudes on the news bitching and moaning back and forth. Keep the laws in place. Keep the carry, you know, permits. Keep the, you know, all, all those permits together. Hunting licenses, you know, all, all this paper trail to document which people have the weapons and you know, what kind of weapons they have, and, you know, blah, blah, blah. So, when there's a fucking murder, guaranteed, nine times out of ten, these motherfuckers that kill somebody aren't going to be the ones that, you know, can be tracked through paper trail. Now, you have this Sandy Hook shooting. This fucking loner asshole who killed those fucking kids and those people... Do you think he had a fucking permit to carry any of that shit? I highly fucking doubt it. I have not watched enough of the news to even know whether he did or not, but I'll probably say no, the fuck he did not have a, a permit or any kind of paper documentation allowing him to, you know, have these weapons. So there's your fucking problem. Stop taking guns away from people who have them legally through paper trail and, you know, all this proper documentation, find a way to get the guns out of the motherfuckers' hands that don't have any of that, because they're the fucking ones killing people. This kid had fucking mental problems. You think he went to a fucking gun store with proper documentation and proper background checks that purchased these weapons fair? Fuck no. He probably took them from his mother or took them from somebody like half these other motherfuckers do. So, there you go. Shut the fuck up about it. Our government's fucking gay as fuck, and they just ruin everything, and all these other politicians, and that faggot Pierce fucking Morgan, whatever his name is, that sits on the fucking news, you stupid fucking newscaster, with no fucking credibility whatsoever, keep your fucking opinions to yourself, cause you're a retard, shut the fuck up.